Hey everyone, it's Tadas. Um, I want to talk about something that everybody's been asking me about, uh, what to pack for Cancun. Uh, we're going on a trip for a bachelor party for my friends Roman and Matt. Uh, they're not getting married to each other, they're getting married to girls. Um, uh, first thing I want to do is get the specs out of the way, the more technical stuff. Uh, I think everybody should carry a carry-on instead of uh, checking in luggage. It's just going to save time and money. Uh, we should all stick with the airline uh, standard specs, which is 9 inches tall by 14 inches wide by 22 inches long, and that's just about perfect. Uh, the next thing we should talk about is the TSA specs for uh, for gels or liquid. Uh, everything should fit into a gallon or a, a quart container even though this is a gallon container and each container should be 3.4 ounces or less. So we have our toothpaste here, we have our toothbrush even though it's not a gel or liquid, it should go in that bag, uh, deodorant. Um, <coughs> this is really important. Uh, sunscreen is a must for us white guys, uh, especially down in Mexico. And then another important issue is we have to use biodegradable sunscreen. That's what these uh, resorts require. Um, uh, if you buy it at the resort, it's going to cost you upwards of 44, 45 bucks. Um, uh, this is obviously larger than 3.4 ounces, so you could just pour it right into a smaller container. This is about 3 ounces, it's travel size. Um, as you can see, this is about a quart with probably space left to spare. If you were my friend Bo, uh, all this hygiene and grooming uh, accoutrement would probably be filled with uh, clothes you picked up off the floor and then the rest of the suitcase would be dedicated to nonsense like impractical sunglasses. Uh, next thing we should talk about is clothing. Um, you know, t-shirts are great. It's going to be really hot out there. Uh, some of us should wear t-shirts even on the beach. Others, not so much. <coughs> um, you could even wear tank tops. A picture of your friend on the tank top should be fine. Uh, in terms of underwear, you don't have to go crazy. Uh, you could go commando. And uh, swim trunks are good for that purpose too, not just swimming. If you ever watch a sitcom or something on laundry day, uh, if they run out of underwear, they wear swimsuits because there's a liner in here probably for that reason. Um, Shorts are always great. It's going to be hot. You know, the nicer the better, but go casual. Uh, I think we're going to have a nice dinner. It's probably included in the package, but I think, you know, we should show our age and wear a nice shirt and, you know, a casual pair of pants. Nothing too crazy. Um, in terms of uh, accessories, wear sandals if you don't want uh, sand in your shoes. Uh, sunglasses are cool, um, hats protect your eyes and your head, uh, you should bring a cell phone uh, for emergencies, uh, and if you have a phone card, I think a lot of uh, Mexicans use it to uh, delay the or remove the international charges. Uh, finally, I've been hearing a lot of grumblings about um, non-U.S. passports, Canadian passports. I think you'll be fine with uh, any kind of passport getting into Mexico. Getting back in might be a different issue. Uh, let me uh, pack, see if everything will fit. Oh, ah! Okay, uh, everything fits, we're ready to go. And if I could just add uh, one more word of advice, I think we should all focus on manscaping. Uh, we're all getting older. Uh, we we want to show everybody that we look, that we try to look our best. Plus we're going through second puberty. So instead of getting hair on our balls, we're getting uh, hair on places like our back and uh, navels and, and God knows where else. So um, that's all I have to say, and uh, I'll see you on the mounds.